You probably have wondered before, how is it that you can withdraw money from Pocket Option? And in this specific video, I decided to make a full tutorial as to how you do it so that you don't have any issues in the future. Hey everyone, and welcome to this brand new video for my YouTube channel. Are you guys ready for a brand new video? In this specific video, we're gonna withdraw around 30 grand from Pocket Option. I think it was like 50 grand on my plan. Uh, yeah, 50 grand on my plan, but I'm gonna give you guys some tips so that you understand exactly how to do it. If you're new to my channel and you're into day trading in general, and if you wanna make money online, then this channel is for you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below and let's dive right into the video. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do today is that we're gonna make a $25,000 withdrawal. So let's go ahead and do that. So there we go, and we got $79,000 like ready to withdraw or available for withdrawal, but we're gonna actually do a $25,000 withdrawal. If you guys are wondering why, I'm going to explain it in just a little bit. So I'm just pasting it and continue there you go we got the first one and the money has been already deducted out of my account now why is it that i wanted to make the withdrawal first because we need to actually wait before we make both of the withdrawals okay now don't take a bonus unless you want to actually comply with whatever they asking you to reply to comply so i actually got into this uh, specific part because i wanted to show you that whenever you want to deposit with your specific uh, broker, this pocket option, um, you're going to be offered a bonus. Okay. So for instance, it's right here. Top of balance of your real account from a hundred dollars and get bonus of 50%. Please continue your deposit. Now, if that basically means that if you deposit a hundred dollars, you're going to get $50 in exchange as a gift. Uh, if you deposit, let's say a thousand dollars is going to get $500 and so on and so on. Now, why is it that I recommend you guys to actually read the terms and conditions in regards to the bonuses before? Because I know there's going to be like a lot of people who don't know that there's, uh, there are certain requirements attached to getting this specific uh, bonus. So my biggest recommendation is number one, that don't take a bonus, or if you wanna take a bonus, take it unless you actually are willing to comply with those requirements. Usually the requirements are that you have to trade with a, a certain amount of trades uh, before you can withdraw, let's say a thousand trades, um, turnovers of, uh, I don't know, $25,000 or I don't know. They're gonna give you the requirements. So my recommendation is go in there and talk to them and so uh, you can ask them any questions, all right? But if you don't wanna take the bonus, that's good. Now, the second tip that I wanna give you is don't withdraw more than five, uh, the 50% uh, of your balance at once. For instance, I had $79,000. If I withdraw $40,000 or more, the broker is going to call me not that they're not going to pay you, but they're going to call me and they're like, hey, uh, Christian, we saw that you want to withdraw your money. We wanted to talk to you and see if you maybe wanted to, uh, I don't know, stop it and you can make a lot more money. You know what I mean? It's going to be a salesperson trying to convince you not to withdraw. If you are convinced and you want to make more money, that's up to you. But I'm just giving you these tips so that you don't actually fall into the trap of not getting your money fast. I'm looking at my uh, withdrawal right here. Um, it hasn't been completed yet for 20 grand, but that's fine. 25 grand. Now, third tip that I want to give you today is don't withdraw more than three times a month. Usually when you do this, uh, the brokers tend to get a kind of, you know, like nervous. They try to get, uh, because you're withdrawing too much money. You, you gotta understand how the business work. I have uh, actually an entire video where I talk to you about, how the business works indeed. So you should know by now that uh, you make money when the broker loses money and the broker makes money when you lose money. I'm not gonna get into details in regards to it. Try to look for it on my YouTube channel. But basically, when you withdraw money, you're actually taking the broker's money because you earned it. So they're gonna get kind of nervous. So two withdrawals a month, and I think that would be good to go. I actually have tested this myself when I had withdrawals. I had one, two, three, four, and five withdrawals during last month, and I do I did get two calls from the broker asking me not to withdraw. It's not that they're not gonna pay you, but 
it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be kind of annoying to talk to talk to those specific people. Now, uh, I don't think it's actually going to be uh, completed within the next. 10 30 minutes it's sunday so but i did want it to uh, I, i'm gonna make my second withdrawal myself later on that's not problem at all but i did want it to um tell you or answer the question in regards to why we're drawing with bitcoin and not other methods because uh, many people are like, hey, Chris, but what about the other methods that uh, you see out there? And uh, I can't really show you the methods right now, but uh, you can find wire transfer. It, this depends on your location. Wire transfer, credit card, pay, uh, I think it's Neteller, uh, Skrill, whatever, uh, Payoneer. I'm not sure. There's a bunch of methods. It does depend on where you're located. But why go with Bitcoin? Because Bitcoin is the only uncentralized currency that you can handle. So it's easier for every company in the world right now to use it so if you actually want fast withdrawals no issues and stuff like that bitcoin is the solution in addition at least myself when i withdraw bitcoin i usually hold it uh, or at least some part of it and then i just keep on holding and i have a portfolio of bitcoin right now that is b getting bigger and bigger but if you if, if even if you actually just want to withdraw your money and start using it immediately i do think that bitcoin is the best option for you so hopefully that actually makes sense as well hey so hopefully you enjoyed the content of this video and if you did smash the like button support this youtube channel but more importantly if you guys have any questions or comments to share you can always use the comment section below and my team will be happy to reply to you thank you very much for watching this video and i'll see you on the next one.